Hello. Um. This is my channel. Yeah, it's pretty amazing. Um. Today, I will be looking at Bite and a Halfs. I think that was his name. His red stump mod. This mod basically does what you would expect it to do, which is redstone stuff. So let's get started. Um, oh yeah. There are stone versions of the button and slab. Just, just so you know. So I'll place them on the reverse sides of these. Um, I've been using glowstone blocks as my testing sub subjects for the redstone. But it will work on all things like red er, doors, any type of doors and stuff. Um, oh yeah, it also adds iron doors into your inventory. Which you could have gotten with too many items or something. Alright, so the lever, you just click it. And it will send a constant redstone signal. Um, the button, you press it. I'm not sure if the stone one or the wooden one is longer, or if they're the same. And then the pressure plates, like that. And then I put redstone, or I put levers on both of these because we need. I need to show you that they work. So, hit the lever, that will be instantaneous. But if you set this for a higher thing, like four ticks, just by clicking it, it will take a longer time to go or stop or whatever. I'll show you an example. Uh. Um. You will notice that in my hand, it looks, some of them look like just random blocks of nothingness. That is because I have a texture pack installed, which you're not supposed to use, but I, it says, I, I like, can't get the original texture pack, and let's be honest, the block launcher pack, the texture pack that they have when you download the game, or app, or whatever, kinda sucks. So that's kind of what this mod is, um, if you enjoyed this video, then uh, leave a like and comment, um, and see you next time, goodbye.